Hey everybody, this video brings us out to Mays Landing, New Jersey. And the reason why we are out here in Mays Landing, New Jersey is because we are at the Far Point, it's a toy show here at Far Point Toys and Collectibles. We're having a pretty good time out here. I'm out here with Chris, we're, we're selling all kinds of stuff. I got movies set up over there. Chris has all his Muppet stuff all set up over there. He's making a killing on doing pretty well as well. I already spent a ton of money out here, maybe within the first, I don't know, I'm gonna say um, half hour of being out here, even before the show really opened up. I um, I found somebody selling a whole bunch of DVDs and Blu-rays for a dollar a piece. And there was some really, really good stuff in there. My friend Brandon, who we'll see in a minute or so, he's out here set up. He was selling all kinds of DVDs and Blu-rays and he even had a figment figure for me as well. So I ended up spending some money on, on his stuff. And before I knew it, I was just um, spending a ton of money and I may have spent probably everything I'm gonna make. Probably everything I make today, I've already spent, but it is, what it is. Look at the weird toys they have over here. Is that Bucky O'Hare? It is Bucky O'Hare. This thing like was that thing that made, oh, it does, there it goes. It croaks. I love the old toys from the 80s and 90s. I had so much of that stuff. Look at the crazy Velociraptor here. Warning, do not feed the variant. So there's all kinds of weird stuff in here. There's a, like an alligator down there. So one of those, what's it called? A, um, like a lure fish down there. I think that's from like Star Wars maybe. I don't know. There's a Yoda. There's a creepy hand coming out of the thing. This is awesome. There's even a, look at that. Is that the, the X-Wing and was it Dago, Dago Ball, right? Luke has to rise it up out of the, um, out of the swamp. That's, that's pretty awesome, that's amazing. Clearly Farpoint does love its toys and its pop culture and movies and whatnot. It's a really awesome and pretty amazing toy store. And every year they do this big toy show. They always invite me out, always come out here, set up. It's pretty awesome. Everybody has all the toys out here. There's so much cool stuff, so many things I'm, tempted to buy. Let's at this guy's actually sold a whole bunch of his um, Blu-rays and DVDs he had, which is pretty awesome. Though he do, does still have the Toy Story Ultimate Toy Box 3 movie collection. I don't need this, but I'm, I'm, like, I'm tempted to buy it because it is so awesome looking. Look at the hearse. Look at this thing. I don't think this is for sale, but that's pretty amazing. Here's the, the giant box full of all kinds of awesome DVDs and Blu-rays. I picked up everything out of here I needed, but I'm tempted to buy more like anyway, just because it's so awesome. I don't know, I might actually have to go through here and make absolute sure, you know what, I am gonna go, before I leave, I'm going go to gonna go through this one more time and make absolute sure I don't need any of that stuff. Because who knows, maybe some of it I need as upgrades, maybe possibly, we'll, we'll see about that. I'm gonna, go through, I'm gonna go through that box again. Look at the skeletons over here, look at the giant skeleton. This thing is intense, look at that. That is nuts. Huge difference also between standing in the shade and standing in the sun. Thankfully, they have us kind of in the back, which might sound bad. Ooh, the back, right? No, the back's great. The back's shaded. There's trees back there. It's amazing out here. It's a little warm. It's a little, a little toasty out here today, unfortunately. Everybody's out here selling all their video games and their toys and their collectibles. I bought some stuff off this guy as well. Bought some toys off him. It's all kinds of plush out here. Definite things I'm, uh, I'm tempted by. Look at this. There's a, yeah, there's a big owl in here. Big owl. I can't, he's, he's upside down, but I assure you, this is, there you go. That is Big Al from the Country Bear Jamboree. That I might end up having to pick up at some point. There's a $40 Wii over here. I might end up picking up at some point. Hey, how's it, how's it going, man? Did you get the center bar? You got it. Right here. Oh, okay. So you still want 40, 40 bucks for this? Yeah. All right. Well, I'm, put it aside. I'll be back after I'm filming. I'll come back and get it. Absolutely. All right. I'm, I'm, picking, up, I'm picking up the Wii for, for me slash my son. It comes with games too. Galaxy and Raymond Raven Rabbits and Wii Play and um, Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. That is awesome. All right. I'm grabbing, a, I'm grabbing another Wii. I'll be back for that in a couple of minutes. All right. I'll put it aside. Awesome. Cool. I'm, I have to pick that up. I need, a, I need to get a second Wii. We already have a Wii at home, but I want a second one. So I'll be picking up that Wii probably for our move down to, uh, to Florida. We need two Wii's down there. Look at this. How's it going? Hey, how you doing, buddy? That's awesome. Yes, yes. <laughs> Very cool. There's all kinds of awesome stuff out here. Again, so many cool toys and collectibles. Me having to be good and not buy any of this stuff, even though it's extremely tempting to buy. I bought like one, I think one toy is all I bought. It was a Dick Tracy figure. Actually, I bought a Dick Tracy figure and a, a little like PVC ET figure as well. And I bought those for a total of one dollar fifty cents a piece. Awesome deal! And then my friend Patricia was out here, and Patricia said, "Oh, I like the ET. Can I have the ET?" And I'm like, "Well, what?" So I gave it to her. So essentially, I ended up paying a dollar for a um, Dick Tracy figure. But it's a cool figure. I'm happy. It's gonna go on a shelf somewhere down in the library. 
Look at all the amazing wrestlers here. Look at that. There's Hulk Hogan. I don't even know who half these characters are, but Hulk Hogan. There's Doink. I'm loving it. There's Sting. There's Sting. Before there, there's Good Sting, and there's weird, like the Crow Sting. I never understood that. Big Boss Man. I love these. These are awesome. I love me some old school wrestling. Do you got the Honky Tonk Man in here? I don't. Oh, is that Jimmy Jimmy Hart? That is awesome. So so cool. There's the there's the Paul Bearer. Yeah, that's that's awesome. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is so cool. I have his autograph at home. That is amazing. All right. There's, wow. I'm digging, I'm digging all these. All the, all the old LJN figures here. These are so cool. I, I so want some of these. I need to get some more wrestling figures for display in the library. I definitely want to beef up my, I mean, my, my, my toys being displayed in the library. I got to beef up my, my toys as far as um, like old wrestling is concerned. I love old school 80s into very, 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 very early 90s wrestling. So... I'll get some of those at some point. Like I said, all kinds of people over here set up selling stuff. There's all kinds of movies over here as well. It's stuff I I think I already have. I don't need any of that. Brandon's out here making making the deals, wheeling and dealing. He's got all kinds of cool stuff. Look at all these awesome pins. I might have to pick some of these up, like the Harley Quinn pin. He's got a lot of awesome pins. Kentucky Fried Idiot. <laughs> okay, I'm, dig I'm digging that pin. That's awesome. There's a Porg. Look at that. So many cool pins. There's Nosferatu, Jack. Yeah, there's a lot of awesome stuff here. I'm, I don't know. I'm probably gonna pick up some pins. He has some cool stickers as well. I was tempted to pick up. Brandon's got a lot of cool stuff. Look at the, the shirt tails. There's the Ray Harryhausen collectible DVD set. I, I want that. I don't need that, but I, I kind of want it. Get all kinds of other awesome DVDs and Blu-rays over here that were really tempting. I did buy some stuff off him. I spent like fifty-five dollars on movies over here in Brandon's stand. So. Maybe I should just walk away before I spend another fifty-five dollars. Don't want to be, um, don't want to be doing that. I need to be, need to be good. Why don't you come back and spend more money? I know. I'll tell you what. You come to my stand and spend some money. Maybe I'll spend some more money at your stand. Deal? Maybe, maybe we'll make some trades. Maybe? Maybe. 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 Okay. All right. Things that, things to think about. Maybe we'll do some trading. I would, I would do some trading for some of the stuff he has. He's got some, um, he's got some things I, I definitely want to pick up from him. Look at all the awesome stuff in here. Excuse me. So much cool stuff. Look at the Godzilla there. See, that's something I would put on display in the library. That's pretty amazing. I'm digging all this stuff. But again, I gotta, I gotta be good. I gotta just walk away. But so many people have like just amazing good deals out here. That's kind of the issue is that a lot of people out here are just like, oh, like a buck or two for these like cool figures or these cool toys. And then I'm like, well, for that price, I kind of have to pick them up, don't I? Right? Of course I do. Look at my display, my, my stand over here. I got, I got people buying stuff. I, li I like this. Looking through my movies, right? You, make, you making me money over here, Chris? You money? Making me money. You money. Making me money. Maybe. 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 Chris think, is over here. I think so. I think so. We're selling all his, his wares, all his Muppet stuff and whatnot. And his, his all Mariah. All Muppet what? stuff. It's an interesting collection of uh, cassette tapes you have there. Yeah, I, believe right. I bought them all in a, in a lot. Wait, I was I with you, wasn't I? That's your lot. Weren't we together? Did you did you buy them in like a case? Together. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I remember when you bought them. I think you had them like a Goodwill inside a case. Correct. It was a whole bunch of yeah. I remember yeah. that now. Okay. Okay. Yes. So we got all kinds of Muppet stuff, and of course movies over here. I'm like some of this stuff. Like I don't think I have Elvira, Mrs. of the Dark on on Blu-ray. I I don't know if I need the the Jack Frost two on on DVD. I don't know. I gotta I gotta go through your stuff. This is is this the actual 3D one? I believe that's the uh, oh the, the 3D glasses, glasses one. Yeah, really weird. They released it in 2D, then they released it in 3D with the 3D glasses, so and, then, and then they released an actual 3D Blu-ray version See, of it. So there's three different versions so, of the same movie. So this will say My Bloody Valentine 3D, and then the 3D version will actually have like the the three D. Ah, uh, that's all in the that's case, how you tell like, the difference. Somewhere, it's, it, it won't say pairs of glasses. Yeah, it's, it's weird. It's 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 weird how they. They did that. Look at the mask books you have here. That's awesome. Mask was such a great show. Wait, wait. What? The mask Where'd he go? I don't know where Chris went. Chris, Chris where's Chris? Wait, Chris, hey, there you are. What'd you do? Hey, what'd you do with Chris? He's back again. <laughs> All right. He's got an album over here. Oh my gosh, look at the Universal Monster Cups. That is so awesome. Yesterday was World Dracula Day. And there he is right there, Dracula. I knew that. You knew that? That's why he's yes, there. Yes, because you watched my retro rest video, right? Uh, uh, of course. Exactly. Oh my gosh, you have 
the Mario figures too. Do you, have, do you have Luigi? The whole set. Ooh, oh, you do have Luigi. <gasps> That's cool. I kind of want the Luigi one. That's it's awesome. All right. Selling the mess, the whole really? Set. Whole set, baby. Well, then I'm walking away. Whole set. Because I'm going to start buying stuff from you. So, all right. So, we're out here having a blast, selling stuff. I'm selling things. Chris is selling things. We're having a great, great time out here. I'm, I'm pumped. I'm excited. I love coming out here every single year for this. Coming out here, spending some money, making some money. 99.9% of the time, I usually end up spending everything that I've. I've made because that's just how how it goes. But I'm I'm okay with that. I don't mind. I don't mind if I come out to these stores and find a lot of or come out to these shows. I should say and find a lot of awesome, amazing stuff. As long as I at least make my money back, then I'm then I'm pretty happy. At least I, I, I if I break even, I feel like today was a success because I've come out to these shows and I'd buy stuff anyway. Oh my gosh, Sergeant Slaughter's here. Hey, how's it going, man? <laughs> what was that? Eddie's oh, I'm sorry. I'm, so, I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. Don't don't beat me up. <laughs> it's awesome. That is so cool. So like I said, we're all having a fantastic time out here. It's amazing. You guys have been out here. Leave your comments down below. They do this like every Memorial Day weekend. It's pretty awesome. Pretty fantastic. And just the toy store in general, Farpoint Toys and Collectibles. It's a really, really awesome toy store. All kinds of amazing deals inside this building right here. You can pick up all kinds of awesome, cool toys and collectibles. Should we actually, you know what, let's end this video going inside and actually seeing this. Look at the Mario welcome mat. So I want to show you guys the actual inside of the store real quick. Look at this. Like how amazing is this? This is the kind of store that could very much get me into trouble. I usually stay away from toy stores because they do tend to get me in a bit of trouble. I come to these stores and I'm like, okay, I want this figure, and I want that figure, and I want this toy, and I want that toy. And then it's just a, just a road I don't want to go down. I'm like seeing an amazing Ghostbuster figures in there. All kinds of awesome stuff. So many toys I had when I was a kid. I mean, that's the issue with these stores. It's all, it's all, it's all nostalgia. You come into these stores and you see the turtles and you think to yourself, I had every single one of these characters when I was a kid, because I pretty much did have every one of these characters when I was a kid, and now I want to get them back into my life. But again, I know better than to do that. Look at the Cobra Commander here, all the My Little Ponies. I want, I want all this stuff. That's why I only collect movies, and I stay away from the toys. Unless it's a cheap toy, which I'm picking up just for displaying purposes in the library. They also have video games over here. Look at this. Ooh. They've got Game Boy games. See, I don't know if I have all these. All right, I'm probably gonna have to come back in here and go through the video games, see if there's any Game Boy, Game Boy Color or Game Boy Advance games I need. So, again, Farpoint toys and collectibles. Look at that, the Han Solo Frozen and Carbonite. That is amazing. So come out here, check out this store. And every Memorial Day weekend, come out here, check out the amazing toy show they do right here. And it's a toy show. It's pretty awesome. Hey, what? Yes, hi. How's it going? <laughs> Do you want to, sh you want guys want to shout anything out? Uh, yeah, I want to shout out. Shout out, go ahead, sh shout out your whatever. Matthew Cofaro. There you go. Ryan. Hey, all right. Wait, can I search this up on YouTube? What's the video? Yeah, it's, re it's on Retro Rest Stop. Retro Rest Stop. Re retro Rest Stop, yep. <laughs> that was awesome. So, all right, guys, that's going to do it, I think, for It's a Toy Show here at Farpoint Toys and Collectibles in May Landing, May's Landing, New Jersey. Look at the amazing flowers they have here. These wildflowers are actually beautiful. So there you go. Far Point Toys and Collectibles. It's a toy store, and this is a toy show. And it's a pretty awesome toy show. I mean, everybody's out here parking on the street. Cars are driving by slowly. They're, they've been honking their horns. We've heard some, like, police cars come by and, like, turn their lights on. Not to be jerks, but just to kind of say, hey, how's it going? Pretty awesome. Pretty cool. Even everybody driving by is having a good time with this toy show. But all right, got to get back to my stand. I gotta try to make some more money because chances are I'm probably going to be spending more money. Probably coming back to, to Brandon's booth. Probably spending some more money here at Brandon's booth. Probably going back over to the $1 Blu-rays and whatnot. Looking through those again. Maybe going inside, buying some video games. I gotta pick up that $40 Wii that they now have on hold for me. So, all right. I'm spending some money today. And you know what? I'm okay with that because I'm making money. So, all right, guys. Like I said, if you've ever been out to the It's a Toy Show, Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of this amazing toy show. If you've ever been out to 
Far Point Toys and Collectibles here in Maze Landing. Leave a comment down below. Let me, know, let me know what you guys think about the amazing toy show. I'm starting to get I'm mumbling. I'm starting to get parched. It's very, very warm right here. Dave is here as well. The amazing Dave Perillo. This amazing Disney art. Buy it. This Buy it guy, all. This guy. This guy. If you're ever in Walt Disney World during the what, Festival of the Arts. Festival of the Arts. Festival of the Arts. Yeah. And you see Farts. this guy is amazing. Yeah. Artwork set up by all of it, by everything. everything. He does the best right here. The best Disney art. Money can money can buy you, Dave Perillo. So, all right, guys. Again, everybody's out here having a fantastic time. All right. I got to get something to drink. I'm very, very parched right now. It's actually kind of warm. This morning, I had a jacket on. It was a little chilly. Now, the sun is beating down on me. It's getting warm. And I need some beverages to quench my thirst. <laughs> All right, guys, so look at this. How crazy is that? It's Potato Chip Man, right? That is, that's all, I don't know. I, my brain immediately went, potato chips. That's what I thought. <laughs> I don't care, it's awesome looking. <laughs> that is so cool. I like it, but they're potato chip head men. I'm, I'm digging it, very cool. And this guy right here reminds me of like some like intergalactic DJ, right? That's, that's what I'm thinking. Potato chips and intergalactic DJ. When I see these, comments down below. What do you guys think of these? This is all your stuff here. Sister Sinister AX, is that what that says? FX. Oh, FX, awesome. Oh, there you go. Here you go, check that out. Very awesome. If you want to get yourself a potato chip head man or an intergalactic DJ, right there. This is the person you get it from. So, all right, so that's gonna do it, guys. Like I said, I need something to drink. I gotta go back to my stand. I gotta make some money. Apparently, I gotta buy a forty-dollar Wii system and probably buy a few more DVDs, maybe a couple of toys as well. Who knows? The, the, the day's young, and I'm gonna be spending some money. So, all right, like I said, if you guys have been out here too. Far Point Toys and Collectibles. It's a toy store. If you've been out here, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think of this amazing toy store. And also, if you've ever come out to the It's a Toy Show, let me know what you guys think about that as well because it's fantastic. I'm out here every year. I'll probably be out here again next year. Even if I move down to Florida, chances are I'm driving up here. I'm coming back for the toy show because it's pretty fantastic. It's pretty amazing. And I highly recommend you guys get out here to the to the toy show, to the to the toy store. You will not regret it. But all right, so that's it, guys. So as always, thank you all so much for checking out this video. Be sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, check down below for links to Patreon. If you guys do become a patron, I will send you a postcard every single month from the road. Also check down below for a link to Spreadshirt where you can grab yourself retro rest stop t-shirts, proceeds, both from Spreadshirt and from Patreon. Do good help supporting the show and keeping the show going. So I really do appreciate it. I think that guy may have bought some movies off me. I think he bought movies from me. All right, guys. So, like I said, check down below for all the different links. If you guys do become a patron, like I said, postcards sent every single month. Also, Spreadshirt. You can grab yourself retro t shirts, proceeds, both from Spreadshirt and from Patreon. Do good help supporting the show and keeping the show going. So, I really do appreciate that, guys. But, all right, again, Far Point Toys and Collectibles here in Mays Landing, New Jersey at the It's a Toy Show. We're having a fantastic time. You guys should definitely get out here. Check out the toy store. Check out the toy show. You'll have a fantastic time and probably be like me and go broke. <laughs> All right. So like I said, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. If you do hit that subscribe button or you are subscribed, then I will see you in tomorrow's video. Ooh, we need a hashtag for today. What should today's hashtag be? I'm now realizing that's the, um, that's the, uh, what's his name? Loki, Loki alligator right there, which is pretty awesome. What should today's hashtag be? be you know what today's i know i know it's gonna be you guys watch this video all the way to the very end you need to you need a hashtag potato chip man if you watch this all the way to the very end hashtag potato chip man that's what i want all right i will see you guys in the next video thanks for watching guys like i said hit the like button hit the subscribe button and if you do hit that subscribe button and i will see you tomorrow all right thanks for watching have a good one bye